Poisson flow is the flow between two stationary flat plates in which a pressure gradient is imposed, for example, with a high pressure on the left and a low pressure on the right. I shall define the x-axis halfway between the two plates and the y-axis vertically and define the distance between the plates as d. The analysis is exactly the same as that for Couet flow. One considers the forces around a control volume and one arrives at this expression in which I have also included the fact that tau only varies in y and p only varies in x. Substituting in the expression for tau, mu dvx by dy, and assuming that mu is uniform, one obtains mu d2vx by dy squared, where vx is the velocity in the x direction, and this equals dp by dx, and this is uniform in space. The easiest way to show that dp by dx must be uniform is to consider what would happen if it were not uniform, but I will leave that as an exercise. This is a second order ordinary differential equation. It requires two boundary conditions. These conditions are that vx is equal to zero at y is equal to plus or minus d upon two. That is simply the no slip condition. With that condition, we can evaluate the constants b and c, and we obtain the expression for vx as a function of y. The point to note is that it is parabolic. So if I sketch this velocity profile, it looks something like this. And as the pressure gradient gets steeper, the parabola gets increasingly high of curvature, and the mass flow increases. And one can perform a similar analysis for a free surface flow on a slope with angle theta with the horizontal. I won't do the analysis here, but one needs to include a body force due to gravity, as well as, of course, the viscous forces.